real men don't wear makeup, right? Right, right. So, how is it being here besides very hot? Are you enjoying uh, yourself? It's very hot, uh, certainly compared to England, where it's apparently freezing and raining, right. as usual in summer. So, it's quite a culture shock. That's so much. How are you dealing with all the speculation about your move to replace Larry King? That's quite amusing. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, we are negotiating over a prime time interview slot uh, on CNN, and we're near the end of negotiations, and we're, we're getting to what I hope will be a very happy resolution. Those are some big shoes to fill. Is that an exciting prospect? That, you know, this is well, look, CNN is one of the biggest news organizations in the world. I think for anyone who's been a journalist like me, uh, I've ran two big newspapers in Britain for years. To be able to do interviews for CNN is, is one of the great sort of holy grails of television. So, uh, very exciting. Yeah. How do you think your style would differ from Larry's? Are you a little bit more aggressive? or? Well, I love Larry King. He's yeah. one of my all-time heroes. So, I wouldn't want to try and copy him because he's a legend. Um, they're the biggest suspenders to fill imaginable. So, I won't even try. I'll just be myself. And, and no suspenders. No suspenders. <laughs> what about uh, the success of yeah, yeah. people on Celebrity Apprentice keep having such success? You know, Brett this year and Sharon Osbourne and everyone. Uh, why do you think it, it helps? Well, Donald Trump knows talent when he sees it, doesn't he? Because he keeps reminding me. Right. Does he does he hold it over your head? Does he like? No, he's great. You? Donald loves it when any of his apprentices do well. You know, he's always kept in touch with me. He's always been really encouraging. And um, when all the CNN speculation began, he rang me and he was really really encouraging. So I really respect him for that. There you go. Well, thanks. Enjoy tonight.